Hello everyone, welcome to JHC Gaming, your number one source for Shotgun Legends news, gameplay, and guides. Before we start, make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on your notifications. Enjoy the video. What's up guys, Johnny here back with more Shadowgun Legends. We're still on the Easter event and in today's video I give you guys all my tips to farm eggs fast. As you see on the top corner I got 612 and it's the end of day 3. We got 14 days to get the eggs to buy the rewards in this event. I totally understand a lot of you guys don't have that much free time and you want to maximize get as much or as many eggs as possible by the time you're playing. So the tips I'm giving you guys you should look for about 100 eggs per hour by farming with a team. Now you'll probably remember this spot, it's in hive mine. It's when you get to the first big battle with the clusters. So as you enter here, you shoot the cluster to start spawning the blinkers and you go straight to the back of the room, all three guys together, and you start shooting blinkers nonstop. You got about a minute or 50 seconds. Kill blinkers, kill blinkers, kill blinkers. Bring the AM bombs and try to rotate, not uh, throw your AM bombs at the same time as uh, your your friends because you're wasting your bombs. Uh, EMP is really good here guys because the blinkers don't blink under the effect of EMP. They're much easier to kill so you will kill more in the 50 seconds frame that you have. Medkit is also pretty good. It helps you uh, staying alive I guess. So if one guy drops a medkit, one guy drops EMP. Uh, these things have fast cooldowns and they stay there quite some time. So collect your eggs and then you're gonna die to assimilation after 50 seconds and you don't have to kill yourself so you're kind of saving time there. And then a uh, quick timer and you're gonna restart right at the door. Look at that, you don't even have to enter the codes again. You don't have to see the flashback or whatever. So once again, back to the room, uh, in the back of the room and uh, start killing uh, blinkers fast. Now, we didn't think about it, but a lot of guys say shotguns are awesome versus blinkers. So you might as well go with your shotguns and whatever secondary you like. Machine gun, I think, is the way to go if you don't like machine guns. Uh, my friend was using rocket launcher and it was doing pretty good with rocket launchers. But the whole point here is kill stuff fast. The more aliens you kill, the more eggs you're going to drop on average per hour. So this tip right here, or this farming spot, will give you about 80 to 100 eggs per hour, depending on your luck. Now, one more thing about loot shoulders. It was asked on Facebook yesterday, and it was answered and confirmed. Loot shoulders does not increase your chance at getting more eggs. Loot shoulders actually increase the rarity of the loot, so not the quantity. So there's no point using loot shoulders. You might as well go with your crit shoulders, maybe, so you kill stuff faster again. So this is a great alternative to farming arenas. It's for a change of pace. Not that it's more efficient, but it's really a change of pace because if you do the same thing all day, every day for 14 days, you're just gonna burn out. You're not gonna enjoy it that much. So I would say alternate, do a bit of arena, a bit of hive, bit of arena, a bit of hive. And uh, yeah, it keeps you fresh, I guess. I mean, we've been doing this for three days. We've been alternating arenas and hive. And it was still fun today. I was uh, chatting with the guys and uh, killing aliens, collecting eggs. The only thing though here is sometimes you might drop an egg as the timer run out and you won't have time to collect it and you're gonna die in front of the egg. It's pretty frustrating. I missed at least three eggs today, I can remember. Uh, it doesn't happen in arena, that's the difference. In arena, you collect your eggs and then you kill yourself. So maybe that's the reason why you might get less eggs but again, it's refreshing to do something different. Now, one more thing we tried yesterday on stream was farming round four of Gold Arena, back to back to back. Uh, and when Blade Dancer spawned, we, we killed each other. So we, we start farming at different places in the arena. We kill because there's a lot of trash mobs. Trash mobs, you kill fast, so you have more chance at dropping stuff. And then when Blade Dancer spawned, I would go collect the eggs at my friend's spot and my friends would go collect the eggs at my spot and then we just kill each other or kill ourselves with the rocket launcher or blade dancer will kill you don't worry about that but i try to collect my eggs before i die of course so that was a great spot and it seemed to be dropping a lot of eggs 
The only thing though, guys, is if you farm for too long and you collect hundreds of eggs, you might maybe crash or, or freeze or whatever. And if you crash, you lose, you have a chance to lose all your eggs. I crashed twice yesterday and I didn't lose my eggs. When I got back to the hub, I still have all my eggs. But anyways, the thing is, if you, what well, we suggest not doing long sessions, grind about 30 minutes, farm eggs for 30 minutes, you get like something like 40, 50 eggs, and then back to hub and then sell your stuff and then go back. So the problem with farming round four of gold is every time you go back, you have to do round one, two, three again. And it's not so efficient. It would be probably more efficient if you do long sessions to do round four, round four, round four, because it really seemed to be dropping more. What we did yesterday was pretty good. So yeah, because of that, like having to go back every 30 minutes and do round one, two, three again, it's not that efficient. But if you're gonna do long sessions, it is risky. So I would probably not recommend that as a first choice, but maybe if you're really bored and you want to try something else, or if you do regular gold arenas, you might repeat round four a couple of times and then finish your gold arena run because it's a good spot, I think. Now, the last one is the silver arena round one. It is a pretty good one and it seemed to be the most popular is you go to round one of uh, silver arena, you kill the stuff at the start and at the end of round one, you kill yourself. Uh, with the rocket launcher so don't forget your rocket launcher am bomb always good and you could go supercharger here to kill the elites faster or of course med kit because it's gonna keep you alive you can take more risk be more aggressive and there's still a chance to trigger the damage bug because it's not fixed yet so you never know if you get more damage of course uh, you're gonna kill stuff super fast but uh, don't expect it to work all the time now, once again, Silver Arena will give you about 80 to 100 eggs per hour, depending on your luck. And uh, yeah, work as a team. And the more you do, you'll start to know uh, the spawn patterns really well. You'll know where to go, where to be, and how to kill stuff faster. Because it's all about killing stuff fast. Be efficient. The faster you kill, uh, the faster you can start again. Because the drops are random. There's nothing you can do. The weapon types don't affect the drops loot shoulders don't affect the drops so it's all random guys play 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 get the eggs get the loot so that is it guys hope you enjoyed the tips hope you enjoyed the video and again if you have other tips that i didn't talk about today please share in the comments because i know the guys will probably read the comments looking for more info and the hive mind was uh, from the YouTube comments on my previous video earlier this week. And it ended up that we really enjoyed farming hive mind. It's really a good change of pace. So once again, guys, mix it up. Don't burn yourself. Alternate one game mode to another. Try different weapons to keep it fun because you're going to burn out and it's not going to be so fun to do the same thing for 14 days. But yeah, it is a grind and I guess we have to do it. So leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, guys. I will be back soon. So then watch my other videos. Take care.